Say, I apologise, I didn't mean to upset you the other day. I Facebooked a humorous joke for me, and I think you took it the wrong way, in all honesty. I was only kidding, so what can I say? Quite a lot, I thought I'd do a video for you today. But, Tres, when I think of Australia, literally, I think of Sydney Harbour. It was a lovely place for me. The best place in the world, it's true. And the Blue Mountains, I never got to view. And now they're on fire, literally. There's no advice a port can give to the firemen, apart from keep yourself safe and the, and the people you see. And if the fires come towards you, what can I say? Leave your possessions, they're insured, and if they're not, it's okay. You need the people around you to be safe and true, so look after your dogs and your pets too. Get out of the way of the fire, literally, and let the firemen get on with their job, instead of arguing with thee. Grab what you need, literally, the things you possess, like your photographs to me, or your memory card, what can I say, and your laptop, and then get away. Don't mess about literally, grab what you need and get away because fire is horrible, it's evil for me. I've looked on it and I've seen it, it's true, it looks like hell, I'm sorry what can I do. But if I could do anything literally, I'd pray for rain in all honesty. I'd want you to have English weather, it's true, it usually rains in the UK, it usually does do. We've had a good summer, I know what they say, but I'd still rather be in Sydney with the fires anyway. Thank you.